so hopefully this works now those who were with me through the whole ordeal of getting this to work welcome back to the stream the ones who are joining us now for the actual stream please hold time so this now works again uh, uh, come on no it's not obvious okay that's fine okay new game new game please i have no idea what we did we did something and it worked i just want to just make it a bit neater Harry Potter lived at number four Privet Drive with his horrible uncle and aunt and their hateful son, Dudley. Harry was often locked in his room, and even though he was a wizard, he couldn't escape because he wasn't allowed to use magic when he was away from school. One evening, a house elf named Dobby appeared. Working. Harry Potter oh. must not go back to Hogwarts. If Harry Potter goes back to Hogwarts, he will be in mortal danger. Dobby disappeared, and shortly after, Harry's best friend, Ron Weasley, and his brothers, Fred and George, arrived in a flying Ford Anglia to rescue Harry from his prison. They flew him to their home, the Borough, where Harry spent the rest of the summer before travelling by flu powder to Diagon Alley. I do apologize once again that we're going to Harry met up with Ron's sister mode. Ginny and went with but her to Flourish and Blots, where the famous wizard author Gilderoy Lockhart was signing his latest book. Great Scott, is that? The music no. or sound effects? Surely not! About? It is! Yes. It's Harry Potter! Same. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the perfect moment for me to make an important announcement. I have great pleasure in announcing that I will be taking up the post of Defense Against the Dark Arts teacher at Hogwarts. Oh. Bet you love that, didn't you, Potter? Famous Harry Potter. Can't even go into a bookshop without making the front page. Leave him alone. He didn't want all that. I just don't know Potter, what did with that you've got eyes. yourself a like girlfriend. I suppose your parents will go hungry razor. for a month to pay for all the books you're going to need at Hogwarts. It's the least I can do to help out the poor and needy. Harry! We've missed the train! The Hogwarts Express left five minutes ago! Oh no! What are we going to do? Well, I know that Dad took the flying car to work this morning. It's parked in Charing Cross Road. Okay, it's our only chance of getting to school on time. Being sure to check bored. that no one was watching, Ron and Harry took off in the old Ford Anglia. Now all we've got to worry about are airplanes. <laughs> I can't see anything in here. There. Uh oh! I think the car's cutting out. Come on, car! Come on! Come on! Just a little bit further. And there's the claim. Stop! Harry. Stop! Stop! I don't know what that 
hours of eventual footage. Okay, I'll see you when I need to change that light so. Alright, All right, here we go. Vines here across the bricks. <laughs> you should have seen the first time we opened this little piece. It looked like cardboard cut out I could open a chest with the Alahamora spell. To cast a spell, press and hold the left mouse button. over low walls to have to walk into them. I can use this gargoyle as a target to activate the Lumos spell. This is a save book. Walk into them to save the current state of your game. When you faint, your game will automatically revert to the point where and when you last touched a save book. Okay. I always like it when they let you remember the spells you learned in your previous game. Because it's so silly when you have to... I bet I can pass for Pendo on that luggage to push it to that ledge. Yep. Very much so, I mean, yeah. And this luggage wait, made like a uh, comet, it made like a groove where it fell. Such as chests and secret doors. No door, Sherlock. Uh, uh. That was not so secret. Oh, black birdie bot beans. I wonder what they taste like. Charcoal? Uh. A chocolate frog. Chocolate frogs replenish some of your stamina. They also taste delicious. When you're trying to catch them, <laughs> I glitched through the thing. <laughs> catch it. Come on. There we go. <laughs> I didn't really need it, but it was good practice. for a pendo on this branch to get it off me. I think I see a sensitive spot right there. I don't know how you can see that, Ron. Do you have eyes on your feet? Pendo! Thanks, Harry. Much appreciated. Oh, you're standing on the ledge. That's not too bad. Oh, no! his flying car. Anyway, we'd better get a move on. We don't want Professor Snape catching us out so late. No, 
it's wrong. Uh, it just feels like I'm missing something, like a secret or something. But the tree is not quiet. Not only does Lumos cast light, it also reveals magically hidden things. <sighs> To jump, run to the ledge and press the right mouse button. Try collecting the beans on all the ledges, Harry. Okay, Ron. Loads of Bertie bots every flavour beans. I should collect as many as I can. They'll come in handy later. to push the block towards me and then use it to jump to this ledge. There's no secrets on the scene. This is a bronze wizard card. There are 50 of these scattered throughout Hogwarts. Each time you collect 10 new bronze cards, you are given a permanent stamina increase. Pressing the escape key will allow you to access the Folio Magi and look at the wizard cards you've collected thus far. Silver and eleven gold. First one we collected, Hesper Starkey, eighteen eighty one until nineteen seventy three, which was studied the use of fa of the phases of the moon in potion making. I'm just gonna. The music seems a bit. soft now let me know uh, uh, uh. Yeah, I can actually fall into the water in this one in the first game I walked on top of the water that's that's an improvement section done or not the 
rain has stopped. At least we'll be dry when we get expelled. Come on! We'd better get up to the school! Now that's much worse than being killed according to Hermione. didn't get lost. It's a nice night now the rain has stopped. I love the sound the secret areas make when you go into them. Dormitory is just over here to the right, remember? No, I have the memory of a snail. I don't remember anything. Right. 
says to my right, but to go to my left. Search for secrets. This is the house point ceremony chamber. Escapades coming to Hogwarts. Coming in if it's night time. Hmm. Oh, yeah, true. Moonlight could also be like this. Very bright. Wait, yeah, I didn't check these ones yet. Use that right now. Not a chamber pot. Andros the Invincible, ancient Greek, alleged to have been the only known wizard to produce a Patronus the size of a giant. the portrait of the fat lady. Give her the password and let's go to bed. I thought you'd have the password. Why would I have the password? 
Why would I have it? I've been with you since we got here. You're right. I better know who would have it. There you are. Right on time. I heard the most incredible story about you two getting expelled over a flying car. Oh, Marnie, please! We're tired! Could you just tell us what the password is? Wattlebird. It's good to see you again, Harry. <laughs> the other two are just like... There you two are. Fish sticks. Brilliant entrance. Got the year off with a bang. Mum's furious, by the way. You two should hear about the bean trading system we've set up. It's based on Bertie Bot's Every Flavor Beans. Fred, myself, and several of our associates have set up trading opportunities throughout Hogwarts. Some of us will occasionally have an item to trade. If you have enough beans, we'll trade with you. Where are we supposed to get all these beans? They're hidden <laughs> all over the place. It's not hard to find them. You should have enough to start trading in no time. It will be a pleasure doing business with you, I'm sure. Once inside the common room, Harry was greeted by the cheers of his fellow <laughs> Gryffindors. Harry and Ron became Gryffindor heroes due to their little accident with the Whomping Willow. Harry slept well that night and looked forward to his first day at Hogwarts. Good morning, Harry. It's time for our Defense Against the Dark Arts lesson with Professor Lockhart. I just love his books. He's such a brilliant writer. Defense Against the Dark Arts on the third floor. Follow us. HP because I stepped in that green goo. Hello, Mrs. Norris. against the dark arts is up here try to hurry harry we'll get to see gilderoy lockhart in person Ugh. that just gives me more reason not to go hi would you consider a trip what do you have i have flubberworm mucus for a limited time only press on the yes button to accept the trade or the no button to decline to you Harry what do you have I have flubberworm mucus for a limited time only as you wish but these are becoming hard to find hi would you consider pardon a trade me. I beg your pardon watch where you're going Sorry, I've run out of stock. You'll have to come back later. Oh, sorry. I just sold my very last item a moment ago. Hello. It's still early in the year, Potter. Anything can happen. Silver wizard cards. 
For every ten silver wizard cards you collect, you'll get a key that will allow you to open one of the four locks on the door. See if you can find all 40 silver wizard cards hidden throughout Hogwarts and the grounds. We'll try our very best, nearly at least Nick, or Sir Nicholas the Pontiff. scary at all hello madam pomfrey i've never seen so many spider bites in a single year oh that's interesting oh are you injured no. safety first harry safety first Establishment of Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. <laughs> Ethelred, the ever ready, medieval dates unknown, famous for taking offense at nothing and cursing innocent bystanders. He died in jail. Alright. Our oh, exploring has been paying off. For those that have not watched me during the the original, the, the first Harry Potter game, um, I am an explorer, I am an completionist, so I do look for all of the secrets I can find. Try to keep it entertaining. Type of if you're never not feeling style, well, be nice. sure to come and see me. I'll fix you right up. Not as big as modern day cans. Look, 
like in 2002. It was quite a quite a fun experience. Hi, Princess Missy T. Ah, oh, no worries. You can look. Don't mind. I hope I uh, entertain you while you do chores. to grow to profess a more heart. You remember where it is, don't you? I'd better get out of here. Filch might be lurking nearby. Well, well, well. I heard a crash, and what do I find? Mr. Harry Potter and a broken, irreplaceable antique vase. Argus Filch, the caretaker, was loathed by every student at Hogwarts. Some thought his cat, Mrs. Norris, spied on students. Honestly, it, it just fell. <sighs> What was that? Hey, what are you talking about? I heard a voice. Hearing voices won't get you off. I'll mark this down against you. Now move along while I clean this up. I must have been hearing things. Yeah. 
Welcome to Defense Against the Dark Arts. My fame makes an introduction unnecessary, but I'll delight you with one anyway. I am Gilderoy Lockhart, Order of Merlin, third class, honorary member of the Dark Force Defense League, and five-time winner of Witch Weekly's Most Charming Smile Award. Ah, I see you've all bought a complete set of my books. Well done. Today, we shall be learning the Rictusempra spell. Rictusempra? is very useful when stunning certain pesky creatures such as Cornish pixies. Who wants to be first? Harry Potter, will you step down here, please? Lucky. Mm, I guess if you want to put it that way. Clear your mind completely, Harry. Don't even think about me. And concentrate on the symbol in front of you. See the wand? It's going to move its way around the symbol. At the exact point when the wand passes over the arrows, hit the corresponding arrow key. This exercise has three parts. You must hit all of the arrows correctly in order to progress to the next round. Ready to try? Round one, begin. Um, well done, Harry. You've advanced to, to the next round. Mouse. Five points to Gryffindor. Round two, begin. Harry Potter's in the R. Uh, well done, Harry. You've advanced to the next round. Those. Ten points to Gryffindor. Round three, begin. Stupid bot in the chair. Very close. Keep it up. You're almost as good as me. Fabulous work, Harry! Aren't you glad you've learned from the likes of me? You've now completed the exercise. Fifteen points to Gryffindor. Thank you. You've learned Rictusempra. You didn't do as well as I did the first time, but then who could? Now, how about a no, turn in the spell better. practice arena? Welcome, Harry Potter, to my famous Richter Semper oh. challenge. To complete Horrible the challenge, robots. you must find the completion star, which will be found at the top of this tower. Try to get to it as quickly as you can. If the challenge timer reaches zero before you have the completion star, you lose the challenge. Along the way, you will find challenge stars. Collecting challenge stars will boost your timer and score. Try and find them all. Try to get the completion star with as many seconds remaining as possible. The higher your score is when you complete the challenge, the more house points I will award you. Ready to begin? Good luck! Three, two, one, go! 
Oh, yeah, I know. It sounds like they're targeting specific people. Fire crabs are nasty little pests that like to shoot hot flame out of... Uh, well, at you. You can stun them by <laughs> casting Richter separate on them. Then you can use Flipendo to push them around. You see where they shoot fire out of. He didn't this indicates say that a fire crab yeah, yeah. placed on or nearby the symbol will cause something to happen in the world, Harry. Oh, Try wow. and use Flipendo to push the this? fire crab onto this plate. Secrets behind his portrait, as empty as his head. <laughs> That's a giant orange snail. Avoid touching them really? or their That's slime trails. The acid that they secrete will burn you. Harry, trust me, I know. Richter Sempra will stun them, and then you can use Flipendo to push them around. Oh, that is not nice. No, 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 the, the bots that are getting um, you guys, I'm reading now, make sure to do a report and not just ban, or they'll be able to I go to someone else. Alright, thank you. Yeah, Metallic Demons are helping me, because I can't go out of this, uh, well I can kind of, but I'm scared the game will glitch out, it was such a mission to get it to work. want to stay in here while it works. by the tip of your tail. Too. We really appreciate it.
the, the cards we got again at the end of the dungeon. Wants to recrawl. Gnomes are a greedy lot. They will try to steal your Bertie Bot's beans. Flipendo will push them onto their backs and cause them to drop anything they might have stolen. You can also pick up gnomes and throw them around. Throw them into a gnome hole to permanently get rid of them. That is a gnome hole. This is where gnomes come from and where they go to deposit stolen goods. That Throw is a gnomes bit of a personal, into these holes um, to permanently get rid of them. You information. I don't know if the gnomes them. want us to know that. <laughs> where they come from and where they go. Maybe they know Cotton Eye Joe. was the very first time the gnome hall was mentioned. What sound is that that the smell is like? Ah, okay. Yeah, the gnome was creepy. <laughs> um. Oh. Oh well, I, I'll try to keep the spoilers to a minimum then if you can, you know, the, the universe and talk about it as we go on. Um, I watched Star Wars only the first time in the universe. Uh, no worries, I knew what you meant. Uh, at university, uh, the only the first sex. Uh, that's the only thing I know about the Star Wars universe. A few movies I watched. Um, <laughs> big nerd. Uh, I was also a nerd.
least if I'm distracting you from cleaning, I know it must be uh, entertaining. <laughs> Thanks, sweetie. I love you too. I'm just surprised how well this, like the frame rate is running on this. I hope it's going well on the stream as well. Okay, so that's decent. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can I can always sing the what, what's the song from Mary Poppins? Uh, the, the spoonful <laughs> helps the medicine go down. So hopefully, it's, uh, the ear full of Harry Potter will make the king go water. <laughs> I'll try again later. <laughs> I might sing from time to time, but I'm really not good. This isn't the like epi epitome of like narcissism. I don't know. How many, how many South African moderators do you think are there on Twitch? There are a lot, okay. <laughs> there are a lot. <laughs> Crustles has gotten away with the worst lol. <laughs> I'll need to check that out. Just have some little time to actually watch. But it's uh, it's been a, a good journey, learning the streaming thing and the streaming community. It's really fun. <laughs> yeah. I tried watching his stream this morning, but it was just like chaos on the screen. I didn't know what was. I didn't even know what he was streaming. It was just chaos. <laughs> It's just like cat girls and then there's like lewd words and I don't know are they supposed to be there or not? <laughs> it's always chaos. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
It's just for wings. Alright, enjoy the cleaning. If I can remember how the lyrics go, I'll, I'll maybe sing you a little bit of a song later. His portraits around. I wish I could flip his head around like that. into the fire crabs hole.
lot of reading afterwards. You do not scare me. I have faced Professor Quirrell and his true face. Soon. Not that I've needed it up to now. Because that's a challenge star on this. If I remember correctly, I can redo these challenges to get a better score. So I'll just do that at a later stage. I see something. Maybe I didn't miss it. Hello, baby. <laughs> Look at all the fire crabs. <laughs> yeah, this is how I get that other star. Yeah. You 
you are no longer gonna know me. Seven out of seven secrets, all of the challenge stars, we can make our way to the end star. Mr. Potter, you have completed my Rip to Sempra challenge. The remaining time now becomes your personal high score. run out of stock. You'll have to come back later. Harry, the weekly half point ceremony is about to start. Follow me and I'll show you where it is. Oh yeah, I promised to see the cards we got. Okay, so... Glenda Chittock, 1964 until present. Popular presenter of the WWN Wizarding Wireless Network program Witch and Hour. Gideon Crumb, 1975 until present, plays bagpipes with popular whistling band The Weird Sisters. Curly Duke, 1971 until present, plays lead guitar with the popular whistling band The Weird Sisters. I really love this outfit, it looks amazing on this person. Um, like the pink dress with the purple guitar. The guy who looks like a Highland Scottishman. <laughs> Perfect. Um, and then Donahan Tremlett, 1972 until present. Bass player with popular wizarding band The Weird Sisters. <coughs> Clover Hipworth, uh, 19, uh, 1742 until 1805, inventor of the pepper up potion, cure for the common cold. Well, wish we had that. Maybe it would help for COVID as well. Mungo Bonham, 1560 until 1659, famous wizard healer, founded St. Mungo's Hospital for magical ailments. And injuries. Herman Wintringham, 1974 until present, plays lute with the famous wizarding band The Weird Sisters. Now, shame, why is this one a bronze card and the other one's a silver card? That's weird. Same with this. Oh, I think we're gonna have a few more of the Weird Sisters here. Uh, Myron Wagtail. 1970 until present lead singer of the popular wizarding band the Weird. so the lead singer isn't even a silver card it's a bronze card uh, heat coat barbary 1974 until present plays rhythm guitar with the popular wizarding band the weird sisters merton graves 1978 until present plays cello 
God of Shida Trusten, 1976 until present, plays drums with the popular wizarding band, the Weird Sisters. All right, I think we've met all of the Weird Sisters now. Good morning, everyone. For those of you who have trouble remembering names, I am Albus Dumbledore, Headmaster of Hogwarts. Welcome to the very first weekly house point ceremony of the school year. The house with the most points wins a visit to the Dean Bowes Room. The length of the visit depends on how many more points they have over the second placed house. Let's take a look at the scores. Hmm. <laughs> it appears that Gryffindor is Those in the lead. Harry, yes. it looks like you get to visit the bonus bean room. Good luck, and remember, you only have a limited time to collect beans. Now this is a fun place to visit. my time Harry there you are glad I found you hello wood time for Quidditch practice Harry oh, none of the other teams have started hell. training yet so we'll have a good head start but I haven't had lunch yet you can eat later follow me to the Quidditch pitch you can eat when you when you can eat but not now How about a trade, Harry? What do you have? I have flubberworm mucus. This will come in handy. Your later purchase on. will make you the envy of your friends, Harry. Sorry, I've run out of stock. You'll have to come back later. trade we buy in bulk and pass the savings on to you hey Harry want to trade what do you have I have Quidditch armor just like the Chudley cannons wear hmm. no, I can't do that. the customer is always right even in cases like this hey Harry what do you have I have a Nimbus 2001 the best model available to the general public Oof, no definitely see yourself can't do that yet. don't know when I'll have these again though Listen up, Harry. We're going to make sure we win the Quidditch Cup this year, and the way we're going to do that is practice, practice, practice. First, a quick recap of what we learned last year. 
Of course, you already know that the red ball is called the Squaffle, and it's the job of the three chasers to get it past the enemy keeper and into one of the goalposts. But you don't need to concern yourself with that. There are also two bludgers flying around, which you don't want to get hit by. But don't worry, each team has two beaters who try to keep them away from you. Last, and most importantly, it's your job as our seeker to catch the golden snitch before the enemy seeker does. Since you've been off all summer, let's start out easy. I'm going to throw up a snitch for you, and I want you to try to catch it. Sounds easy enough? Now the rest of the Gryffindor team is here, so let's play a mock game of Quidditch. <laughs> Avoid the Bludgers and the other Seeker. I'm going to have a Gryffindor stand in as an enemy Seeker. You'll need to make sure she's out of the way before you can catch the Snitch. Don't worry, they'll take it easy on you. Excellent work, everyone. You're back on form, Potter, which means we've got a great chance of winning the cup this year. Aren't you finished it, Harry? Don't look now, but here comes the Slytherin team. I don't believe it. I booked the pitch for today. Hey, they've got new brooms, and, and they look like... Yes, they are. They're Nimbus 2001s. Yeah, I know. Apparently, Lucius Malfoy made a very generous donation. Like our new brooms, Weasley. What are you doing here, Malfoy? I'm the Slytherin Seeker now. Didn't you know? Perhaps someday Gryffindor will be able to afford new brooms. Well, at least no one on the Gryffindor team had to buy their way in. They got in on pure talent. No one asked your opinion, you filthy little mudblood. You'll pay for that one, Malfoy. Well, at least I could afford it, Weasley, unlike you. Leave it, Ron. He's not worth the trouble. That was a very, like... Mudblood. The nasty name some wizards fight. use for other wizards who were born to non-magical parents. And speaking of mud, October arrived damply at Hogwarts, spreading a soggy chill over the grounds and into the castle. A different kind of chill would soon set in as well. class with Professor Snape. We don't want to be late. You know what he's like. It's down in the dungeons. Follow me. I'll have to watch that first to see. Yeah, yeah, I can. Oh. Mm-hmm. Professor Snape can wait for me. Okay. I haven't got anything to trade at the moment. Come back later oh, when I've had a chance you. to replenish my stock. I'm pretty sure there's going to be a secret thing here because he keeps looking here. Hey, Harry, want to trade? We have the best values in Hogwarts. Spiders, they give me the creeps. I'm sorry, me too. Good old 
called Hagrid's Hut. The pigs are not happy that I'm taking their beans. Set up unicorn reservations throughout Britain. That's nice. Of them. Both are strong now. Why for this old I don't know. if I want to get that Quidditch armor and stuff. No time to talk. All right. All right. I think I'm just gonna. Hey, Harry. What's a no, trade? I know you guys we are buy a boat and pass the savings on to you. I'm just gonna explore here a bit, and then I'm gonna go to potions lesson, and then uh, I think I'm gonna call it for tonight. Would you be interested in trading? What do you have? I have wigget tree bark, free of impurities and bark beetles. Thank you, Harry. We value your patronage. I haven't got anything to trade at the moment. Come back later when I've had a chance to replenish my stock. Entry bark. Uh, we will see now when I go to potions lesson. leads to the dungeons. Really? I thought it uh, led to the observatory. <laughs> no, it's because I'm using stray for left uh. and right. Is it better? Uh, it's just because I'm using the mouse that's actually better. prefer controller over mouse and keyboard, especially for these type of games. But you aiming with the one is not much better. Um, I guess you don't aim with the one that much. No. Yeah. No, and I mean with analog stick it would be the same as if I was doing it with my... Because standing still. Squish. Squish. The spiders. Yeah. Amazing 
what they could do like with the year uh, extra. <laughs> Explosion slots. Now pay attention. Today you will attempt to learn the art of mixing one of the most useful potions ever concocted, the Wigan Weld Potion. Potter, you have just volunteered to show the rest of the class how this is done. Get up here immediately. A Wigan Weld Potion will restore some of your lost stamina. Even a single bottle is capable of healing the most grievous wounds. In this chest I wish I could are have the two some of ingredients this. of Wigan Weld Potion. Flubberworm mucus and Wigan Tree Bark. Take them out. Now, walk up to the cauldron. Try not to touch the potion. I don't want it contaminated. Observe Mr. Potter adding the ingredients to the cauldron and mixing them. Careful, Potter. You don't want to lose house points. Mr. Potter now has a Wigan Weld potion. To drink the potion, press space bar. Back to no, your it's seat, not space bar Potter. For me, but thank you. Those of you who are adventurous, or more probably clumsy, will no doubt want to make Wigan Weld potions on your own. Therefore, there are cauldrons like this one throughout Hogwarts. They are the only cauldrons in which Wigan Weld potions can be made. And the ingredients, flubberworm mucus and Wigan tree bark, can also be found throughout Hogwarts. Now for today's lecture, the history of flubberworm mucus extraction. Hmm, that sounds fun. Before that lecture, I thought I knew everything I wanted to about flubberworm mucus, and I was right. Well, I thought you touched on some interesting aspects. Let's get going before Snake comes out. What was that? What was what? That voice. It was coming from over there. Come on. of the air beware. Oh, that's horrible. What's going on? Enemies of the air, beware. You'll be next, mudbloods. She's been petrified, but how, I cannot say. And now, I would like everybody to please return to their dormitories. There's nothing else to see here. Come on, Harry. 
Professor Dumbledore's right. There's nothing more to see here. Everyone at Hogwarts was disturbed by the attack on Mrs. Norris and the mysterious words scrawled on a wall. Rumors and speculation spread. Hermione in particular was especially affected. Ron and Harry became sure that she was up to something, but whatever it was, she remained tight-lipped. <clears throat> we have to get to Charms class, Harry, and I have an idea. An idea about what? We should ask Professor Flitwick about the Chamber of Secrets. He's bound to know something. Let's go. Sounds like a good idea. It's not like no one wants to talk about it. Um, I don't know if it saves stuff like this. I think it saves. I don't know where the safe books are in the overworld, so I'm gonna check them. Hurry up, Harry! We don't want to be late for charms. Coming, Hermione! Hi! Would you consider... What do you have? I have flubberworm mucus, for a limited time only. Glad to sell to you, Harry. What do you have? No. I have flubberworm mucus for a limited time only. As you wish, but these are becoming hard to find. They're going to become very important later on. Yes. Oh, sorry. I just sold my very last item a moment. Sorry. I've run out of stock. You'll have to come back later. Has anyone seen Hermione Granger? Why? All right, that's a save game. All right, thank you for everyone watching. Um, I'm gonna exit so I can see who's in the stream. Oh wait, wait, wait! Did we get a new? I don't think we got any new cards. No, we didn't. Uh, yeah, exits. And then. Oaks to Elisi Dra, Alien Gathering, another TV viewer, Drapsnat, Metallic Z Man, Nina Teller, and small streamers, DC Community. Thank you for Do you want to raid anyone? being with me. Oh, I didn't see that Missy he said bye. Oh, just just now. Just now. Yeah. Alright. Bye. Bye. You want to raid someone? Uh we can. Uh how type uh slash raid. Slash raid. And then this person's name I think is cool. T R A E Okay, and then I just say send. Yeah. Okay. And then at the top something should come up. Yeah, yeah. Um. All right, let's raid. Um. Okay, you the chat's gonna switch to this chat now, so you can say like hi. Uh, let's see. Let's give this person some some hearts and claps. Uh, verified accounts chat only. Verified. Oh, oh my goodness. I'll send messages for you. Oh. I'm verified. Are you gonna verify it? Oh. It's gonna take a while. Not really. Just type it in when it okay. goes through. Um, at Password. Um. What is my password again? Um. 
Okay. Did your code? It will be on your phone. Yes. Oh one. What? Now I can send you hi. Ooh. Playing Final Fantasy. <laughs> he asked how you're streaming. Did you hear? Sorry? He asked how you're streaming. Hi. Uh, sorry. Very active mode. You can stop streaming now if you want to, Zara. Yeah.